Hey guys, are you wanting to buy best smart camera glasses? Then you are on the right place. Our today's video about best 5 smart camera glasses that are available in the market. If you want to know price and more information about the products that mentioned in this video, you may check the link in description box below. And now let's continue. Starting at number 5, all 4K ski goggles. It's a pretty specific use case, but ski goggles with a built-in camera involve fewer straps than a separate action camera and get the lens closer to your eyes. OLO have some traction in the camera sunglasses market, and these video ski goggles seem to incorporate the same tech, right down to the 70-degree field of view. That doesn't feel quite enough, but it's very useful that it can be tilted to suit your natural head position if you remember to do it. And if you opt for the Y5 version, you can check the video on an app. Though it's 4K capable at 24 change via a text file and USB link, it defaults to 1080p60, which for most will be better for the slopes. At number 4, Shiwa C Camera Glasses. There are situations where it'd be handy to record, and video quality is less important than discretion and price point, which is where these unisex style glasses come in handy. With a CMOS tucked behind one of four holes in the front, they don't scream spy. Though it doesn't do anything for the image quality. The micro USB charge socket is positioned in the left arm, above the ear, and the switch is on the inside too. Unlike some of the big name models, there's no internal memory, which may be useful. A TF card up to 32 GB can be slid into the end of the arm when the glasses are open. At number 3, Bear Grylls BG GLS. Including U400 polarized lenses and clearer alternatives, these are designed for all kinds of outdoor activity and explorers will appreciate that I-66 certification has been achieved. The glasses come bundled with a strap and case. We must admit, we raise an eyebrow at the marketing materials reference to solar technology. We're guessing that means UV filters in the shades, as there certainly isn't a solar panel. Charging and downloading is via a supplied USB cable. Storage is via 16 GB internal space, meaning regular downloading will be needed, though that will balance with the charging assuming they are done together. OnePlus, in a market with many unknown Chinese brands, is Grill's personal brand being attached to this. At number 2, Snapchat Spectacles 3. If you're in the Snapchat world, about two-thirds of 18, 29-year-olds, as of 2021, you'll understand the benefits of a look that stands out and straight from the box. The styling is unique. The images stand out too. Spectacles 3 added a second camera and assorted visual effects before Ray Ban slash Facebook thought of it. Actually, the price and tech. These even have a charging case compare closely with so your preference in glass style is key. Images can, after all, be exported from Snapchat. Snapchat also offered cheaper single camera glasses, Spectacles 2. Link, these seem more chic. Expect to capture about 70 videos or 200 photos on one charge before putting in the case to top up. The case is USB-C charged. Our last product, Ray-Ban Stories. At first glance, the Ray-Ban Stories are like any aviators you might find sold by the lifestyle brand. Look closer, though, and you'll see a full suite of modern smart features that elevate them above and beyond your average pair of sunglasses. There are two 5MP lenses built into opposing ends of the glasses to get a sense of depth in your images. They're not stunning quality compared to the cameras packed into some modern smartphones, but the ease of taking photos on the go is the real draw here. Photos are captured at 2592 zone 1944 pixel resolution, whereas more taxing video capture drops to 1184 zone 1184 pixels, 30 frames per second instead. There's a color indicator on the front of the glasses, which lights up when camera recording is in use. That's a handy feature when it comes to letting those around you know you are recording, but it's important to respect the privacy of others at the same time. Given these smart glasses aren't ubiquitous or readily recognizable hardware just yet, there are two open-air drivers that are placed near where your ears will be, allowing you to listen to music without having to stick headphones in, on, or over your ears. So what do you think about this video? If you think this video is really helpful to take your decision easier, kindly subscribe our channel and click the bell icon to notify our upcoming video. Thank you for watching this video.